today's concept if the sum of some non negative net numbers is zero then each number should be zero basing on this concept we will do one important sum you see suppose one equation given algebraic equation solve x square plus x minus 132 whole square plus x square minus x minus 156 whole square plus x square minus 2x minus 168 equal to 0 whole square equal to 0 this one we have to solve it seems to be very difficult why because here quadratic equation whole square is there so you will get a fourth degree equation while solving fourth degree equation so many things we have to use but the concept is here the sum of some non-negative terms are zero then each number will be zero you know that the square of any real number is non-negative so here three terms are there all the terms have whole squares so all the three terms are non-negative so this implies first term x square plus x minus 132 whole square equal to 0 therefore that equal to 0 and second one x square minus x minus 156 equal to 0 third one x square minus 2x minus 168 equal to 0 now you can solve by using splitting middle term the factors of first one is x plus 12 into x minus 11 the factors of second one is x plus 12 into x minus 13 equal to 0 the factors of third one is x minus 40 x minus 14 into x plus 12 equal to 0 if you solve these equations individually x equal to minus 12 11 second one x equal to minus 12 13 third one x equal to minus 12 14 but all should be 0 that's why your answer will be x equal to minus 12.